People have a conception of bicycles that either they're for exercise or, you know, the classic story of you ride a bike until you get a car and then you just kind of forget about the bike because the car is what big people drive. But the bike is, it's a simple, elegant machine that has a lot of power and a lot of functionality. My name is Chris Nucci and this is the Compost Collection by Bicycle program uh, in coordination with Saco Parks and Rec and the Bicycle and Pedestrian Advisory Committee. I'm an avid bike rider myself and I love the idea of you know, running errands, doing things locally via bike. And I thought it would be a great opportunity for us to get out and be in front of the community by collecting compost, which we don't have a collection system for here. We're reducing the number of car trips that people are making to drop off their compost. And, you know, we did it in coordination with Age Friendly Saco. So it was really meant to be geared towards people who might not have the ability to get out and bring their compost to the community center. Keeping this food waste and all this stuff out of the landfills and putting it into compost is a major way to reduce methane emissions. We can expand the number of volunteers that are going out and actually running the collection. We can definitely expand the number of people that we're picking up from and hopefully that'll get more people composting that aren't composting right now. The convenience factor is huge, especially when it comes to compost. If you don't know what to do with it and you're just collecting, you know, food scraps in your house, I mean, it, it can get a little messy. The way we run the program right now is essentially the same as your garbage and recycle pickup. You know, the people that are in the program have got a little countertop bucket or they use their own five gallon bucket and they just put it out at the end of the driveway and I just drive by, scoop it up and go. Garbage to Garden, who this program is coordinated, turn it into a helpful fertilizer that you can put on the garden. It feels good to do something for the community. You feel like you're contributing to not only the community, but not only Saco, but Maine and you know the world as a whole in some way. It's been a really rewarding experience this last year, you know, and I think anybody who gets involved will get that same sense of reward out of it.